subscribe to Cyber Secrets Reveal and press the bell icon to stay tuned. Whether you are browsing on web or finding any solution online or editing or playing multimedia or playing a hardcore games, Windows has everything, everything is customizable. So let's install Windows. To install Windows using USB you need a bootable pen drive and I'm gonna show you how to make a bootable pen drive without using any tool. I'm using command prompt. Just open command prompt and inside command prompt type disk part. This need administrative privileges so give disk part the administrative privileges and once disk part is open type list disk. This will show all the disks that are connected. Here you can see that I have two pen drives connected and I am be selecting disk 2. Okay, now I am going to clean the files inside so I am going to type clean. This will delete all the files within the USB. Make sure you have backup of your files. Once disk part is succeed in cleaning the disk, you need to create a partition by typing create partition primary. Now select the partition number 1, format it to NTFS format, so type format FS is called to NTFS quick. This will quickly format the partition, this may might take some time. Because Windows need NTFS format for bootable installation of uh, Windows through USB, now you need to type active so that the partition you have formatted will be active and at last type assign. So once your pen drive is assigned, Windows will automatically open the pen drive and I'm gonna leave this part and if I go to computer, you can see that my pen drive is now bootable. So once your pen drive is bootable, you need to copy the Windows installation files. If you are installing Windows 7, Windows 8 or Windows 10, the steps are same. Just copy the Windows installation files to your USB. Here in my case, I'm going to install Windows 10. So I'm going to copy the Windows installation files for Windows 10 and going to paste that files in my uh, USB. You can see that my files are copying to my USB. This will take a lot of time, so I'm going to skip the video. Once my files are copied, I need to restart the PC. Here you can see that my files are copied. Close everything. I'm going to close the windows, the command prompt and now I'm going to restart the PC. First of all, connect your USB to the machine where you want to install the windows and power on the machine. You need to enter into the boot selection device. So here you can see it says press F12. So I'm gonna press F12 and it says entering to boot menu. And in boot manager you have to select the USB where your Windows installation files are kept. Here you can see that Windows logo appears. Here goes the processing uh, icon, and it might take time. Uh, depends on how powerful your CPU is. The basic step is to select the language time and currency format keyboard and or input method and after selecting all the options click on next and then install now it says setup is starting now you need to accept the license terms just click on the box you can read the license terms and then click next. There are two options, one is upgrade and one is custom. I will go with custom. And here you have to select the partition where you want to install the windows. Make sure that you have selected a partition where previous windows was installed. Otherwise you will lose your important data. After selecting the partition, you can format it for clean installation. Otherwise if you have uh, enough space required for windows installation you can install without formatting it click on format and you can format it and after formatting it just click next and your windows will be installed within few minutes when you click next windows installation file will be copied and windows installation starts your pc will restart several times and at last you have to enter your username and password and pc name and you can enjoy windows Subscribe to Cyber Secrets Reveal.